sir? I have faith in it. Move to reconvene. <laughs> Second. Roll call on reconvene. Mr. Walter? Yes. Mr. DeCarlo? Yes. Mr. Hoffman? Yes. Mr. Kondek? Yes. Mr. Molina? Yes. Old business? Old business? New business. New business. Motion to adjourn. Second. Roll call on adjournment. Mr. DeCarlo? Yes. Mr. Hoffman? Yes. Mr. Kondek? Yes. Mr. Molina? Yes. Mr. Walter? Yes. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Here. Mr. Hoffman? Yes. Here. Mr. Condick? Here. Mr. Molina? Here. Mr. Walter? Here. Mr. Silverstein is excused. Minutes approval minutes from February 10th. So moved. Second. Roll call. Mr. Hoffman? Yes. Mr. Condick? Yes. Mr. Molina? Yes. Mr. Walter? Yes. Mr. DiCarlo? Yes. Acceptance of financial reports. Move to accept financial reports. Second. Roll call. Mr. Condick? Yes. Mr. Molina? Yes. Mr. Walter? Yes. Mr. DiCarlo? Yes. Mr. Hoffman? Yes. Are there any amendments to the agenda? No amendments, Mr. Mayor. Comments from the public, 30 minutes maximum time, five minutes per person. Raise your hand, state your name and address. Laura? Hi, my name is Laura Leonard. I'm the director of the Turnsford Public Library. I'm wearing two hats tonight, though. I wanted to thank you very much for your donation to the Interact Public Turnsford Mass Party Dance. We had 52 students in attendance, and six of whom live in Reminderville. Um, so that's a little percent of the prize, and that was very good. Um, your donation helped um, supply dinner for them. We had a dance instructor that came in and taught them the waltz, the cha-cha, the rumba and stuff, and they all got up and participated and learned. It was very good. Uh, this grew out of the fact that the students kept saying that they didn't have any winter formals to attend. And I've worked with teens ever since I was a teen librarian in the various volunteer groups. And so many of the teens in our school district contribute so much. They bring good recognition to the district because of their volunteers and their academics and athletics. And this is a way to return it. Um, throughout the evening, they were also able to raise almost enough money to buy a shelter box which is a box that the Rotary International puts together supplies, and if you're in a natural disaster, they ship these shelter boxes all across the world so a family could live in the shelter for a year if they could get back into their home. So this is just a, a group of kids who really um, deserve to dance, and they really appreciate it. I sent a video on to Mr. Hoffman, but I couldn't get the technology to work for all of you, but, but I will find a way uh, because the students wanted to express their thanks, and they also... Um, you'll be getting a personalized thank you note from them, so they wanted to make sure that you're aware of that. The other reason I'm here as the library director is that all of your constituents are also constituents and patrons of Twinsburg Public Library, and I think sometimes they forget because you're so closely blessed with the Twinsburg Library, the Aurora Library, and the Solon Library, so everybody makes their choice, but we wanted to remind them of what they have available at the library that their property tax dollars go towards. Um, we have things that you can be in a cold home and just read from your home, download with your library card, including ebooks, audiobooks, movies, magazines, and Hoopla, which provides movies, music, audiobooks. And we just applied to um, Zinnia, which is magazines, so you don't even have to buy your magazine, just read it on your iPad. And also, we just subscribed to something called Udemy, and there are free online classes, everything from learning how to sing to Microsoft. And we are the first library that has joined this company who usually sells subscriptions to businesses. So we hope you check us out. And just a couple more things to mention. We have a drive-up service, so you don't even have to get out of your car. You can call in for whatever you need. We also have retro gaming systems and games, including Nintendo, Super Nintendo, and Nintendo 64. So if you want to introduce your kids and grandchildren to the, the good old days, you can do that. 
Obviously, we have story times and activities for children, and all our story times are planned to prepare children for early learning and being able to read. So it's not just your pleasant, let's go have a, a story today. They're all built around the skills that kids need to be ready to go to school. And also, we have notary service, and we have passport services by appointment. So this is just a few of the things we're doing in the library. I know my staff has met with your Parks and Recreation Department, and we hope that the library will become more involved with some of your family activities that we have. And so I appreciate your kind listening, and again, your donation to the Internet Club was greatly appreciated. Thank you. Thank you. Anybody else? Laura Hoffman, 3755 Surfside Circle. Um, Mayor, I was not at the last council meeting, but I would like to extend my thanks for the very wonderful volunteer dinner that you had for the volunteers of the community. And as we all know, the volunteers add so much to this community, and it's really nice of you to acknowledge that publicly. It was a lovely dinner. And please extend our thanks to Stacy because I know she did a lot of the organization for that. It was really a very nice time. And I would also like to thank Ms. Leonard and the library for um, wanting to partner with the Parks and Recreation Committee. We had some really nice ideas about things that maybe we can do to encourage more reminded of residents to participate at the library. And it's a wonderful resource for not only the community, but for our Parks and Recreation. So thank you very much, Ms. Leonard, and thank you. Thank you. Um, first off, I that's a, that's a thank you from all of council um, to dinner and stuff like that. But Stacy did a ton of work on it. Thank you. And, and if you would have been here last week, you would have heard me go on and on. What a great <laughs> volunteer you are! <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure we'll probably come back and tell you. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Oozed all over you. Thank you. Anybody else? All right, Ordinance 8, 2015, Emergency Ordinance to make appropriation adjustments for the 2015 village budgets. Move to suspend the rules and pass by Second. Roll call. Mr. Molina? Yes. Mr. Walter? Yes. Mr. DiCarlo? Yes. Mr. Hoffman? Yes. Mr. Condick? Yes. Move to pass by emergency. Second. Roll call. Mr. Walter? Yes. Mr. DiCarlo? Yes. Mr. Hoffman? Yes. Mr. Condick? Yes. Mr. Molina? Yes. Ordinance 10 2015, an ordinance amending section 19102 of the codified ordinance for Monterey, Ohio, to add the definition of pension for purpose of taxation. Second reading. Ordinance 11 2015, an ordinance to amend section 13914B of the codified ordinance village of Reminderville pertaining to holiday pay for police department personnel and declaring an emergency. Move to suspend the rules and pass by emergency. Second. Roll call. I apologize, I didn't hear that ordinance number. Ordinance 11. Mr. DiCarlo? Yes. Mr. Hopkins? Yes. Mr. Pendick? Yes. Mr. Molina? Yes. Mr. Walter? Yes. Move to pass by emergency? Second. Roll call. Mr. Hoffman? Yes. Mr. Pendick? Yes. Mr. Molina? Yes. Mr. Walter? Yes. Mr. DiCarlo? Yes. Ordinance 12, 2015, an ordinance to amend section 13916D. Four of the codified ordinance of the village of Reminderville pertaining to unused comp time for the police department personnel declared emergency. Move to suspend the rules and pass by emergency. Second. Roll call. Mr. Condick? Yes. Mr. Molina? Yes. Mr. Walter? Yes. Mr. DiCarlo? Yes. Mr. Hoffman? Yes. Move to pass by emergency. Second. Go ahead. <laughs> Second. Roll call. <laughs> Mr. Molina? Yes. Mr. Walter? Yes. Mr. DiCarlo? Yes. Mr. Hoffman? Yes. Mr. Pendick? Yes. Resolution 11, 2015, a resolution authorizing a $2,000 donation to the Taste of Twinsburg event. Second reading. Resolution 12, 2015, a resolution authorizing a $100 donation to the Twinsburg After Prom Committee. Second reading. Resolution 13, 2015, a resolution authorizes $100 donation to the Aurora After Prom Committee. Second reading. Resolution 15, 2015, a resolution to approve the change order for Trimore Corporation amount of $128.41 for the work associated with the 2011 paving program and water line replacement project. Second reading. Move in. 
We need to pass. This needs to go by emergency. Move to suspend the rules to pass by emergency. Second. Roll call. Mr. Walter? Yes. Mr. DiCarlo? Yes. Mr. Hoffman? Yes. Mr. Pandit? Yes. Mr. Molina? Yes. Move to pass by emergency. Second. Roll call. Mr. DiCarlo? Yes. Mr. Hoffman? Yes. Mr. Pandit? Yes. Mr. Molina? Yes. Mr. Walter? Yes. Resolution 16 2015 resolution authorizes directed the fire chief on behalf of the village of Reminderville to file a grant application with the Ohio Bureau of Workers' Compensation to be used for the purchase of a striker power cot and load system. Second reading. It's okay. I probably should go by the person. I don't know that it's time crunch, but there's no problem with him going ahead and getting the application. All right. Move to suspend the rules of pass by emergency. Second. Roll call. Yes. Mr. Walter? Yes. Mr. DiCarlo? Yes. Mr. Hoffman? Yes. Mr. Condick? Yes. Move to pass by emergency. Second. Roll call. Mr. Walter? Yes. Mr. DiCarlo? Yes. Mr. Hoffman? Yes. Mr. Condick? Yes. Mr. Molina? Yes. Resolution 18 2015, a resolution award the 2015 annual HVAC preventive maintenance contract to DeMarco and Associates LLC. First reading. Resolution 19 2015, a resolution to approve the preliminary term sheet for the Village of Reminderville Rec Center project. First reading. Okay. Yes. Can we do that by emergency? The term sheet? No, it's a preliminary. Okay. Old business. New business. Move to adjourn. Second. <laughs> Roll call. Yes. Mr. Hoffman? Yes. Mr. Pendick? Yes. Mr. Yeah. <laughs> 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 <laughs>